to say thank you uh, before we ask for prayer requests. So you come on up and do that, Roger. First off, I want to just thank the entire congregation here and out there for prayers and for support. I have never felt so support in my life. You helped me get through this without any problems, period. And I kept thinking there were, you guys were holding me up. I really, really believe that. And I was so awed by the hospital that I thought it was wonderful. Secondly, on a more personal note, last week I had got myself into a dither. I saw papers every night and my car broke. And that's like a dancer losing a leg because I was apoplectic. I couldn't get anybody to work on it. I couldn't figure out how to get it from point A to point B. I was apoplectic. Well, Andre has always been my prayer chaplain, forever. And so I called her. In one minute, on the telephone, one minute, she took about 60% of my problem onto her shoulders. For the next day and a half, Andre and Tony carried me around, listened to my gripes, gave me a car, helped me in every single possible way. And I just, I got from that, if you got a problem, speak up. If you got a problem, speak up. God will answer you and it'll probably come from one of us or out there, us, but, you, but they have to know. God knows your problem, but everybody else doesn't. So if you have a need, speak up. And so with that, Andrea, I love you. Thank you. Tony, I love you. Thank you. Reverend Judy, Dan, thank you. To the whole congregation, thank you. Here and out there. To unity, thank you. To God, thank you. Namaste. Namaste. Oh, that was wonderful. What a, that... That was a good message for today, so I don't even need to say anything. Oh my goodness, how wonderful. Um, he called us, did